Hello and welcome once again to the rugged Rockhound. Today I'm once again back at the Nephi Petrified Palmwood area. This area is a great area. It's a new year and we did have some heavy rainfall about a week and a half ago. So we are hoping that we can uh, find some good stuff that's been revealed. So I was taking a look here. <laughs> that one time I was here that I found that big piece, it was right here. And it looks like since then some people have been digging seeing if they can find any more of that wood. Hopefully they found some good stuff. We're gonna go ahead and move, I'm gonna head over this way. This is where we're finding the colorful pieces of wood. And it looks like it's been trampled a lot by some cattle that have come through here. So maybe they've overturned some stuff for us. And as always, I'm always gonna give you the GPS of where we're at so that you guys, if you wanna come out and find some stuff, you can come here too. And Tim wants to show me that he maybe found some wood already. And sure enough, he did. Look at that. Nice little piece of wood right here. Um, yep, it's got the pores in it. It's definitely some palm wood. Uh, you probably won't be able to see that very well on the camera. So we'll give you a close up later of it. But yeah, Tim's already found a piece of petrified palm wood. Let's get at it. Let's go find some wood. Hopefully some colorful wood. I really hoping, yeah. Last time I was here, this is where I was digging. We uh, dug this area a bit, and this is where we found those nicer pieces right in through here. But look at what has happened since we have been here. Look at all of this. Somebody tore this place up. Yeah. Goodness. Somebody really went to town up here. Probably found some good stuff moving this much dirt. Well, we're going to kind of set up our base of operations right through here. And we will dig as well as like go explore. I want to explore some more over there. But, you know, just anywhere. Just see what the rain has washed off. Got a little lizard here joining us. <laughs> Holy moly, that is pretty. Oh, what'd you find, Tim? That's a big chunk of the red. Uh, it's wood. That is wood? Yeah, you got the li li lines, of, lines of wood right there. Oh. Oh, good piece, Tim. That is wood. Nice find. Let me spray it off really quick. So as I was spraying this off, Tim found another one. Let me bring him out here in the sunlight where we can actually see them and enjoy them. Look at that, beautiful. That's a nice piece of wood right there. Not the palm wood, this will be the uh, kind of the oak wood. And we got another beautiful piece right here. Very good. Well done, Tim, we're in the zone. Looks like a piece. <laughs> a little piece of wood. Looks like Tim got a small piece of wood again. It's translucent, you can yeah. see through it. Very dirty. Yes, it's very Yeah, dirty. you can see light coming through it. Yeah, there you go. It's right and, there in the wall. Yep, nice. Another little piece of wood. We'll get that cleaned off later. Found my first piece finally. Yeah, darker piece. I found half of it, the little pieces. <laughs> he found a few little black chips. And that, that, found out that they were coming from the tip of it. That counts. <laughs> Yay. 
Found another little piece. Don't know how well you can see that. It is very dirty. I tried to spray it off, but these are very dirty pieces. We'll get them home. So we didn't find anything for quite a while. We've been digging a lot. One thing we've noticed is there's a, this greenish ash layer, and then there's the white layer on bottom, and most of the wood that we find is between those. These little pieces, they tend, tend to be in between those. So we're going down about, I'd say about six, seven inches, about six inches at least where I'm at, and that's about where I'm finding it. So I've been looking around right here. So we've been digging over there and decided to come over here, take a break from digging, because we weren't finding a whole lot for a while. And we got some pieces here. There's some old pits here. I've been here before. And we were thinking of maybe coming in here and digging through this. Oh, this is cool. What'd you find? There you go. It's on the other side. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's some nice wood. So it's white on the outside and black in the middle. That's pretty cool. That's a fun little piece of wood. I like it. I like it too. Okay, we'll look some more around here. Let's see if we can see anything. That catches our eyes. That looks like some wood. It is. Once again, a piece of wood that's been out sitting for a while. So in this spot, I've been finding a bunch of little shards of opalized wood. And then I found this nice piece of wood all in this little zone right here. And I just saw it here. Let me see if I can find it again. <laughs> just saw it. Where did it go? Dang it, I lost it already. Ah, right here. There's a little piece. There's a bigger one though. Where did it go? I just saw it. It was right in here. Why can't I see it now? I moved that stick because it was right next to it. It was right in here somewhere. Where did it go? Gosh dang it. How did I miss it? How can I not see it now? So you got these little shards of opal everywhere. right in here somewhere where did it go there it is that's it oh yeah that's what i saw Ooh, look at that because it broke off of the because i grabbed that looks like we've got some opalized wood here oh there's another piece all right save some pieces for me now now this is my spot i found it oh here's some more pieces Good, good, good. That's the only spot I kind of want a piece. Right through here. Right in this. So just in this, it's got to be like one particular spot. That's a piece know? too, right there. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's coming out right in here somewhere. <clears throat> so at the base of this tree, I found a few uh, nice little pieces. Tim, however, says he found something nice down at this tree. We'll go see. Oh. Because I'll say it's nice. Oh, we don't know. Nope. I haven't even picked it up yet. It looks nice and you haven't even picked it up. Point it out. Oh my goodness. Look at that. I haven't There's even picked it up There's a nice piece yet. of wood. That's a good sized piece of wood. Yeah. Nice. Too bad it's so fractured, but that's because it's been out probably sitting on the surface of the ground for who knows how long. Nobody's ever seen it. That's the biggest piece today so far. I see something pretty right here. That looks like it's probably some wood. It is. Nice. Where did it come out of? Might be right through here. We came back into the tree area. Tim's been finding some little pieces here. And I found this one right here. That brown. That. Yeah, can you spray that for me? It's kind of like the piece I found. Oh, good. Where it's like dark in the middle and then yeah. light on the outside. 
Yeah, it is. Look at that. That's a nice piece. There's more here then. Yes. Tim's got a good spot. Tim says he found a good one. Let us see what he found. Ooh, look at that thing. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> oh, that is so nice. Good find. Found me a piece in this area. That's pretty nice. Is that another one? No, that's just agate. Found a piece. What we got here? So these are the stick. So it might be the very edge of wood. Yeah, looks like you've got the edge of some wood right there. Yeah. Interesting. And we're back from the petrified wood near Nephi. I just got everything cleaned off. It's right over here. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at all these pieces. We got some pretty nice stuff. Here we go. Let's take a look at the first piece. So this looks like it's more of that oak wood. And I love how it had this darker spot right in the middle. <laughs> it's kind of cool. This one was a bit strange. It's very dark. Hard to see any of the patterns in it. You do have some of this agate going through it. But yeah, you can see it's wood. It's got the wood texture on it. So it's a very interesting dark one. This one was a little broken piece. It had some red lines going through it. But you see some of the nice textures, patterns going through it right there. Too bad it was just white and colorless mostly. But it does have some red here. This one wasn't too bad. It was kind of nice. It's got some agate here and there going through it. You can see the nice wood pattern on it. And the interior is pretty nice too. This is probably the best side to look at it from. So yeah, this is kind of the best side to look at it from right in there. Now we're getting into some of the better looking stuff. This was a nice brown, probably oakish, oak type wood. I'm just saying oak wood because that's kind of what it's most closely resembles to today's plants, trees. This little piece, it's really nice from this side. So, yep, more of that oak type wood. Still a very nice piece. I love the lines in it right there. This piece is a little bit more colorful, isn't it? I love this little zigzag of red it does across the top there. And it looks nice all around. So yeah, this was a very nice piece. Now this is a piece I wish I would have found a big piece of. <laughs> Look at that. That is beautiful. The lines, the colors going through it. Just a nice piece. This is a really neat piece. While the inside isn't all that great, the outside's really cool. The beautiful knotted wood texture going through it there. just neat. So here's another piece of palm wood. You can see the black pores. Well, they were replaced with a, a black, black chalcedony quartz type thing. So yeah, you can tell that was palm wood. So yeah, nice little piece of palm wood. This was my favorite piece of palm wood that we found. Once again, you can see the little pores in it. with a nice color. But the reason I really like it is, look, it must have been the outer edge of it because look at that, that's kind of that bark-like texture you get on the outside of palm trees. Well, so you've got the palm tree itself and then you've got the layer of the, where it connects with its bark, basically, and its bark would have been out here probably. But look at that, isn't that a cool texture? And here it is, the pride and joy, the best piece we found. And once again, Tim is the one who found this one. So.
So this is the winning piece, the best piece. So well done, Tim. But yeah, from this side, look at that. The colors, the lines. It's just beautiful. And it's a good size, too. And even the outside looks really cool. And there you have it. There's the wood we found on this trip. Some good pieces. Just to goes to show that even a place that is well known and has been dug for a long time can still produce good stuff if you're willing to search a bit and maybe dig a bit. So if you're ever if you're going out there, that spot where we're digging, it has been dug a lot, but if you can kind of search around for where maybe it hasn't been dug as much, dig down a little bit, you should be able to find a few things. But maybe the best thing to do is to start exploring further away. There might be some good pieces of wood in a deposit that hasn't quite been found yet out in that area. I don't know. Worth looking for, right? <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed. I don't know when we'll get back out there. We're probably done with that spot for a while because I really want to get out to some new places for you guys. So let's get working on that. All right, until next time, there's treasure everywhere.